Hi, I'm Bryce. And I'm Shannon. And this, and this is, is why, why we give to St. Mary's. It's the second week of our new season of stewardship at St. Mary's Episcopal Church in Stewart. And we've asked the Coopers to share why they give to our ministry. We asked the Coopers, how long have they been attending St. Mary's? Uh, we started at St. Mary's about 10 years ago. What was it that drove their decision to join St. Mary's and their continued giving of time, talent, and treasure to God's kingdom? My children and I volunteered at J.D. Parker. They all went to school there. Uh, but we, as they were getting older, the little ones would volunteer with me and we would work with the backpack buddies and we would put all the food together and then we would deliver it to the students in their class. So after a few months of doing that, I said, well, who's, where's all this coming from? And it was St. Mary's. And so that really drove our decision because St. Mary's was a church that was in our community and it was serving our community. We've had a lot of really awesome opportunities to serve at St. Mary's. Um, the most recent one is that we got certified to participate in the Safe Families Program, which uh, is also giving up your resources. There's many different roles within that program, but we really want to work toward being generous as God is so generous with us. And so that is our money. We do tithe, but it's also wanting to open up our home um, really just to be welcoming. We asked them to share their illumination on giving at St. Mary's. You know, I hesitate when it comes to things like that, but you know, I feel the, the pull and the tug from God. And when we decided to start giving, um, it was something that I had been thinking about and didn't really bring it up because I consider myself a frugal person and we were going through some times and just like everybody else is. But Shannon um, mentioned something to me and it, she was feeling the same pull and tug that I was. And so I figured, let's, let's, you know, if this is what God's calling us to do, then let's do it. And if, you know, it absolutely uh, destroys us, then, you know, we can always stop, but, you know, we, we haven't stopped. I don't think that I've ever had an experience where I've, I've said yes to God when I feel that, um, where I've either been disappointed or He's not done something really amazing in me through that saying yes. So I think that, that would be what I would say. Please consider increasing your 2024 pledge in this new season at St. Mary's.